the old man. I, uh, I, I don't know how to describe him. I mean, you said you thought he was stalking you at first. Did anyone else in your group think that? Well, yeah. We, <laughs> Is it possible they could have killed him? What? No. No, you, you, you don't understand. Don't you understand? And if he attacked you. He saved my life. And I watched him die. He held it right up to my face. Right here, right in front of my nose, and he could have shot me. He almost shot me, the prick. I mean, you go out with a guy for however long, and you think you know him, but man, this one really takes the cake. How did you end up in the mines? I was carried and um, taken, and... What did you see? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I thought we were close. After his sister's disappeared, he'd come and talk to me. He said I was the only one who understood him. I thought... I thought we had a connection. If you need someone to talk to... I'm fine. Sometimes, after a traumatic experience... I said I'm fine. Why did you hit Josh? He was acting like a maniac, and I... I had to stop him. I thought you said he was tied up. Yeah, but... Okay, all right. Okay. I know it looks bad. But you don't understand. He was trying to fuck with our heads. About Matt, have, uh, have you found him? No, not yet. Yeah, well, don't look too hard. You don't sound very concerned. Fucker left me to die. He said he was my boyfriend, but then he basically murdered me. Would you give a shit? Mike. What do you remember? He came for me. He did. Came for you? Where is he? Did he make it? It was my fault Mike died. I wasn't supposed to move, but I did. And he saved me. So it's my fault that he died. You need to listen to me. I don't care if you believe me or not. It doesn't matter because you will. You need to go down to the mines. What's in the mines, Sam? I've seen what's down there, and I'd give anything to unsee it. <laughs>